Hey everyone, today I got some hot off the press insights on the Colorado real estate market thanks to a comprehensive article from the Colorado Association of Realtors that was just posted on coloradorealtors.com. And a big shout out to all the experts who contributed. So what's the scoop? Higher mortgage rates are making buyers more cautious and sellers are starting to adjust their prices and offer some concessions accordingly. Good news for buyers. Statewide, inventory is down nearly 15% and it's even tighter in the Denver metro area. Homes are also staying on the market longer with an average of 29 days in Denver, a 38% increase from last year. Now, let's talk numbers. Despite these challenges, home prices are still on the rise. The median sales price for a single family home is 580,000 statewide and nearly 630,000 in Denver. Now zooming into even more local areas, in Aurora, listings have plummeted, dropping almost 40% in some zip codes. Boulder is seeing an 11% decrease in new listings since January. And in Colorado Springs, the median sales price has taken a dip by 2.1%. Now let's not forget Douglas County where I live. The number of single family homes on the market climbed by 6.6% in August. Despite this, the median sales price is a whopping 759,000, significantly higher than the Denver metro area. So what's the outlook expected for winter? Expect the market to cool down further. Sellers will face more challenges and buyers will likely remain cautious. We're all adapting to this new normal in real estate. To wrap it up, whether you're buying or selling, staying informed is your best strategy. So reach out and let's just have a conversation on your goals and how I can help you. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button, share it, and follow me for more updates. Till next time.